17-14. The Steelers are clinging to a narrow three-point lead as we get set for the fourth quarter. First down, 10 to go. Delayed handoff, and he makes it out to about the 17-yard line. Coverage downfield. Look out, heavy pressure on him. Loose ball. Pittsburgh recovers it. Fight for the loose ball. Who's got it? Pittsburgh is able to fall on it. The Steelers win the battle and they keep possession. Not even sure who got to that ball first. I think it changed possessions a few times at the bottom of that pile. But the offense came away with it and they earned it. He's going to pass. Throws it into coverage. Easily intercepted. He's dropped down at the 17. Why would you make that pass when you have the lead? Don't ask me. He threw it. I have no idea which side of his brain was working on that one. They'll give it off here. He gets out to about the 15-yard line. Not much, maybe two yards on the carry. Second down. Here we go. Has a man to his right. Little flip. It's a touchdown. They've come from behind to take the lead. Point after is good. Philadelphia is up by four. Let's take a look at the drive summary presented by Verizon. Well, the hands team is on the field for the return. I guess they're expecting an onside kick. The kick is high, but short. He's brought down at the 29-yard line. I'd imagine that the special teams coach is not very happy with that return. Well, you work on something over and over during the course of the week and then to have it fail miserably when you get into the game situation, it's just embarrassing for everybody, especially the coaching staff. He's wrestled down at the 40. Caught the defense a little by surprise that time. They were looking for pass that time all the way. They go with the halfback delay and pick up a big first down. Handoff up the middle. And he's tackled at the 47-yard line. He lets it go. He's brought down at the 31. The Steelers are putting together a good-looking drive here. That's their third first down. Dumps it out right. Comes down with it. He's tackled at the 25. He'll take plays like that all day long. Second and five coming up here at the 25. Flips out short, misses the receiver, and it's incomplete. And now the offense will be faced with a third down situation. Third down and five to go. Short pass to his left.
looks like they decided to go for it here. Pass is short right side. And the Steelers will have a first and goal. Ben Roethlisberger throws the ball so hard sometimes, I'm amazed the receivers can even catch it. They probably have to ice their hands after the game. First down and goal. They need to get this one into the end zone. Short throw to the right. Touchdown! And they're back on top. And this attempt will give them a three-point advantage. Point after is good. With just over a minute to go in regulation, the score is the Steelers, 24, the Eagles, 21. This is a good opportunity to take a look at the drive summary presented by Verizon. Line drive kick, very short. The Eagles are now down by three, so that means they need some yardage to at least get into a makeable field goal situation, but I think they're looking for more than that. And he's hit as he lets go of the ball. Rashawn McCoy was the intended receiver. Pass rush almost got there that time, and uh, he has to feel a little lucky that that ball just fell harmlessly to the turf. Just gets it away. LaShawn McCoy was the intended receiver on the play. Well, the defense didn't get the sack, but they got the next best thing, and that was a bad throw. It's third and long, and at this stage of the game, there isn't much doubt that they'll be looking to air it out to convert. Gets the pass off. He's dropped down at the 35. Boy, that's a tough throw and catch that time. Tight coverage, able to thread it in there, and good play by the receiver. Surveys the field. He makes another catch. LaShawn McCoy has 10 catches in the game. Here's the pass. He's brought down at the 41-yard line. Jeremy Macklin finally gets a catch, his first one of the game. Has a man to his right. Little flip. LaShawn McCoy was his intended target. They line it up at the 41. Passes it short. He drops the easy pick. LaShawn McCoy was the intended receiver. Pretty obvious passing down here. The offense facing a third and long situation that they need to convert. And this one looks like it will be the against the defense. defense. There's nothing that deflates a defense more than a third down penalty. You keep the drive alive. Your defense gets fatigued. It just can't happen. So that penalty makes it third and five. He gets off the throw. It's picked off, and that ought to do it. And that throw will cost them possession. Well, you always hear that sometimes it's better to just take a sack, and clearly there it would have been. Of course, it's really easy for us to say we don't have those 300-pound guys chasing us.
Gives it right side. He gets to about the 24-yard line. You know, one of the dangers of blitzing is that if you can break that first line of the defense, now you just don't have the pursuit in behind it to stop the run. He's tackled at the 26-yard line. He takes a knee. The Eagles call a timeout. And they call their final timeout of the half. They go with the kneel down. That'll wrap it up from Philadelphia. The game's top highlights are next. Our final in this one is Pittsburgh 24, Philadelphia This 21. has been a presentation of EA Sports and Madden NFL 11.